Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So um, today I want to put my hair into two plaits and it has been quite highly requested that I do a tutorial for this so I thought I would just film it. Um, so I'm going to do my hair in two Dutch plaits today um, with a side part. Now a few people have asked me about how to get a straight centre parting. Um, today I'm not going to do that because I have this little fringe so that doesn't really go very well into a centre parting so I'm going to leave it out of the um, plait um, but I will just quickly show you if you want to do a centre parting kind of how to how I achieve that so firstly I get my brush and I just brush my hair straight up like that just quite gently so that it's just all like that and then I get a comb with a pointy end but um, if you don't have a comb pointy end you can just use your finger or um, a knitting needle or just anything that has um, a little bit of a point at the end and I actually kind of line up from my nose and go straight up like that and then create the centre parting um, but if you don't really feel like your nose is necessarily in the middle, you can kind of go from like between your eyebrows straight up and then just take that all the way up and split it. That's really badly done because I'm not doing it properly. But um, it might take a few tries to get it exactly central, but that is how I do that. Um, but yes, yeah, so for today, I'm just going to be working with the side parting, but I am going to do centre parting down the back. Um, if you're doing centre all the way then you can just keep measuring all the way down the back of your head um, if not you just kind of want to try and feel roughly where the centre of the back of your head is and just use your fingers just to measure down for me personally I'm not overly fussed if it's like completely dead straight but if you want it to be super straight then you could if there's someone else around ask them to have a look at it to make sure that it's straight or um, again kind of using the comb use that to help make it more straight or what you can do which is quite difficult is to um, get a mirror and then use the front facing camera on your phone or another mirror to kind of angle yourself so you can see the back of your head um, so I'm just gonna, now that I've managed to get my hair in centre parting, I've just tied one side up into a little bunch so that it stays out the way. Um, and I'm also just gonna grab my fringe and just take it across to the other side of my head and clip it. Just so this stays out the way. And now we are ready to start plaiting. Okay, so I'm starting off with just a small section at the very front of my head. And I'm gonna split this into three. Like that. And now I'm gonna take this section on my part line underneath the middle like that and then do the same with the hair on my hairline so take it underneath the middle like that and that is your first um, stitch of the plait so now what you're going to do is pick up a little bit of hair, however much you want really. Obviously the smaller pieces you take, the longer it will take. Um, and the kind of more tight the plait will be. So I'm just going to take this bit and add that into the section on my part line. Like that. And then once again just taking it underneath the middle. And then I'm going to do exactly the same on the hairline. So taking a little section of hair, adding it into there. And then taking it underneath the middle section. 
and you're basically just going to carry on doing this all the way down the head until all of the hair on this side has been incorporated. start to do now as I kind of begin to bring in all of the hair that is kind of around my face is I'm just going to push up a bit so that it, this gets a little bit looser and I'm just going to pull out a few little um, baby hairs I'm going to use just to frame my face. just to carry on plaiting down as normal so taking the side underneath the middle and then the other side underneath the middle at this point it's getting really really difficult for my arms to reach so what I'm gonna do is bring my hair round to the front so I'm gonna hold it all in one hand I don't really actually know how to kind of describe how I do this so I'm just going to um, kind of try and show you okay and now I'm just going to continue just plaiting this down And then I'm just going to tie it at the end just with a normal hair band. Okay, so now that first plait is done. I've got a few bits out around my face. And I'm also going to unclip my fringe and bring that back over to this side. So that is one plait finished. And I am very, very, very tired out. Um, so I'm just going to go and have a little bit of a rest um, and then I will come back to do the second pack so it's now about half an hour later um, so I'm going to do the second plait so firstly obviously just going to take this hair band out um, and yeah I'm just going to do exactly the same as what I did on this side but on this side I have some um, like little shorter bits on this side as well like I did last time, I'm just going to clip that over on this side.
and then I'm just again showing you how I bring my hair round to the front. this hairstyle complete so I really hope that you have all enjoyed this video and that you found it helpful um, if you did please do give it a big thumbs up and comment below any hair tutorials that you would like to see me do in the future um, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and I will see you all again very soon with another video